This episode of Philly First 48 is brought to you by Top Dog Law. The number one internet lawyer in the world. Listen, right? If you want to get top dollar for your accident, hit up topdoglaw.com or follow him on Instagram. Tell me you listen. I knew niggas that look hard, but they soft. Act strong, but they weak. Reckon like Rico, saying niggas go and talk to the law, you know. Tell them what they seen, heard, and saw. Like them boys murdered my homes. That's what I call one revenge for my dogs, you rats. Worse than the tree when they killed Rick and he wanted to get out the car. Niggas claim they going hard for these dogs. Give me a 40 in the clip bout. Long as tomorrow, and that's 24 hours. I got 24 hours. I ring shots. I could give a bum a hot shower. A sharp shooter. So I'm trying to knock a pile out the chopper. This show just begun, but I'm the fucking show stopper. Like high school, I'm the boy that smacked the bully by the locker. Who well, now that I'm popular? I run J Street. I'm talking mass back to popular. Fucking bad bitches. Exotic. Pete Collada mixed with vodka. My nigga got it. Took 12 shots. Ain't one get saved by the doctors. Fucking hot is bad. Yeah, that's true. It's getting me, Biggie, with the weight off, man. I finally got with this. I finally got with this guy, man. Yeah, oh, yeah. Man. What's up, man? What's going on, bro? I know if you saying like it's hard to catch up with me, but you know I'm being jail. I got a phone stolen in jail, man. Go on, man. man. Listen, I want to say this, man. I see you, 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 like you working. You still working, even in your circumstances, man. You just dropped the seed. Of- you know what I mean? Yeah. When you motherfuckers like, let the people can't. know, like, you know they what I mean? They the can't defeat me, man. Rock. Good. I'm at it. I'm in a space like this, man. All right. I'm fresh off a guilty verdict. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Being framed for a murder, it gave me life plus like 25 to 50. Set me next mm-hmm. door to death. They set me next door to death row, Mac. You dig what I'm saying? So it's Crazy, just like, man. like. I ain't like my. I ain't down to nothing. You dig what I'm saying? Cause my whole thing is, I know they trying. Like they want to defeat me. You dig what mm. I'm saying? So it's just like mm. my head. My head ain't down, Mac. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like mm. I just came mm. off of, and that's why my head ain't down. For real, for real. I'm not bitter. You dig what I'm saying? I'm mm. not a bitter nigga. You dig what I'm saying? Like I ain't mad mm. at the world. You dig what I'm saying? Mm. But I'm coming off. I'm fresh off my mom dying. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So it's like it's nothing. It's nothing more crazy you, than that. Up. I'm not to cut your wisdom at all. You say that, like you say you fresh off of your mom. My, my mom dying. My mom died last year. Oh wow! You dig what I'm saying? Wow. I I didn't even know that, bro. I want to. I didn't even know that. That's tap right into that. Like you losing your mom in in these circumstances and shit like that. I didn't even know you lost your mind. Sorry for your yeah. loss. I want to first say that. But speak yeah. on the pain, that that, that the, the, the trauma. Yeah. You know what I mean? The shit, like the shit that you, you know what I mean? You have this bro, experience. Listen, it's so mind crazy, mind. bro. I still got my mom's text messages in my phone, man. You know what my mom always tell me, man? Skinny, you purple hearted. Mm. Her everyday text with me when we gone when. Mm. You understand? You understand what I'm saying? Wow. wow. Two weeks late. Two weeks later, like my mom died. Mm. One of the most beautiful souls, like on this planet. You get know what I'm saying? Rare. Wow. I mean, wow. like my twin, my number, like wow. my number one supporter with everything. You dig know what I'm saying? Like. I like know. My dude's up and died out of nowhere fucking with that co- corona shots, man. Wow. I didn't know my... that, son. I, yeah. I fucked up about that shit because I know how y'all relationship was, you and your mom, dupes and shit like that. And, yeah. you know, I'm just so sorry to hear that, man. I know that was, y'all, y'all relationship was different. That's how me and my mom, you know, is at the, t- like, you know, currently. So I ain't know you took that out. I did not know yeah. it. you took that out of my condolences, man. Yeah. For real. Man, they took my queen off my chessboard, man. That's the only thing I'm sorry about. Wow. Like, like, listen, no bullshit. When I realized the court shit was like on some political shit, you dig what I'm saying? Yeah. I was expecting like a worse outcome. Mm. My, my, that shit with my mom, I'm sorry about that. Wow. Only like that, I'm sorry about that. This time they gave me, Mm. For murder, I'm being framed for. Don't worry about that. I ain't crying about that. I ain't <laughs> head, my head ain't down about that. 
I hate wow. them. I bought my mom dying dope. You understand wow. what I'm saying? Like, I'm sorry yeah. about my mom. I'm sorry about my mom dying. That's why I, wow. I, I try. That's why I try to tell everybody. Like, I even told this to my lawyer. I said, "Listen, dog. When he was trying to box me in, it's like to convince me to take a deal. I'm like, nah. I said, mm. my mom. I said, my mom died, nigga. I can't face to face with a fear, nigga. Wow. That was my only. That was my only fear. I can't face to face with that, man. I ain't scared of these people. Who gonna have fight these people? That's why I went in there and did with with no with, with no regret. You, you understand what I'm saying? It don't matter the outcome. I ain't had no regret because I wanted to see what was down the street. I wanted to see what was around the corner. You understand what I'm saying? And like right. I said, like the title sound harsh. Life hmm. plus twenty five to fifty years. That's not to cut harsh. your wisdom. I want to start right there. I want to start right there, man. Life plus twenty five. You know. Yeah. I just remember like it was yesterday, two weeks now, Ben, you know what I mean? We first got the news, uh, you know what I mean? Cause, you know, shout out to the litigator. He was in the courts, you know what I mean? Yeah. Supporting, you know what I mean? But, you know, it was it was real tough getting the news. Like, you know what I mean? Knowing, knowing that, you know what I mean, you ain't have a, have, have a chance. Like, and basically that's what you're saying. You're saying that you ain't have a chance from the rip. It was political from the beginning. I, I see from that the you, beginning. You dig what I'm saying? And it was just like this, man. Only thing that was missing, it was a high profile case. The only thing that was missing was the fucking news cameras, action news, Fox, whatever, whatever. That's all that was missing. You dig what I'm saying? All right, it framed me for a murder at the peak of my career, at the height of my face. That's my first question. I'm going to start right there. Why, why do you think you. Why the, the cops would frame you for for a murder? Why 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 would that come over your mind? Like let the people know, you know. What I mean, you think they used the rapping shit on you or no, your character knowing your bloodline? It's like, it's like, your this. Line? It's what, like what is it different about you like, and, and other other people that's going to do your same situation? It's like, it's, it's like this. First and foremost, it's my bloodline, man. You dig what I'm saying? Like mm. my mom had to like deal with being harassed by police. My aunt, you understand what I'm saying? My brother uh, Bayak, the whole city know. My brother mm-hmm. Bayak ain't kill a nigga he got life for. Everybody know. Uh, the nigga Bay got the Bay got life for a nigga he ain't kill. Wow. A nigga, my man killed my man August fifth. Then my man got killed. That killed him August fifteenth. Mm. If Bay I killed him, why Bay I can get killed? Mm. <laughs> you, 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 you understand what I'm saying? Like, wow. so my whole thing is like, it's like, like they just like be after. It's like, it's like, I mean, they gonna they gonna put our names on all kinds of shit. They mm. gonna put our names on shit, cause we can't help them. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? It's just like. Right. Strange, and I want to jump in. Strange, I want to jump in and let the people know, man. I want so so you saying it, it stem from be, from the beginning, you know, starting with your brother, your aunt, your mom, your bloodline. First, yeah. I, I want you, let's take let us take the people back. You know what I mean? First, I want to say you you want you from one of the darkest spots in North Philly, one, one of the one of the darkest sides. You know what yeah. I mean? Twenty ninth and Jefferson, like the high the high I mean? numbers, the high numbers, the, the high numbers. numbers. The border, sure. Twenty Ninth and Jefferson, man. Twenty Ninth and let, Jefferson. Let the people know. Let the people know. Skinny me before skinny me. Your story. My whole John is like, I'm like rare. You dig what I'm saying? Everybody mm. know. Everybody know I'm rare. You dig what I'm saying? And it just mm. like, what make me like so rare is that like, I ain't real. I'm like rare. Like I'm mm. rare because like. I stand and stood on everything like a real nigga ain't stand on, man. I love that. I love that. Like, I really did, man. You dig what I'm saying? It's not like, I'm not a petty individual. I'm not trying to, like, trip a nigga to get in front of him. I'm not trying to mm-hmm. pull you down. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, you know how they say one hand wash the other, both wash the face, and the nigga that's trying to pull mud over your head, on top of your head and shit. You, you know what I'm saying? I ain't that nigga. You dig? You dig what I'm saying? Like, 
I'm trustworthy. Yeah. I got consideration. I'm generous. You, you, understand, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's just like, it's certain things like in life where it's, as a man, as in growing up, sometimes you just got to stand on business. You understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And around my neighborhood and for my neighborhood, stood on business. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? So it was like, like we grew up, grew up rough, man. Mm-hmm. Like we grew up rough. You understand what I'm saying? Like real rough. Like I'm talking about like, Matt, we from the high numbers, Matt. I know, I know. We from a certain street. We, we from the we from the other side of like you got the other side of Broad Street, then you got our side of Broad Street, Mac. But the people know. You you you, you, you dig what I'm saying? Like to where it was like, come on, man. Like, and I want to say this, just to add to that, I went to Kelly's, William D. Kelly School. That was my elementary school. Mm. You know what I mean? Uh, I just remember, like, you know what I mean. Y'all side, 29th and Jefferson, because y'all whole side, we went to school, you know what I mean, together and shit like that. Y'all side, like, rolling Mo Parks and shit like that. A oh, few God. other 30 people, like, your whole team that you, you know what I mean? I, you know what I mean? So we grew up, but I want to say this. I always knew it was just different. On, it was a little bit different on 29th and Jefferson and shit like that. It was just a little it bit too like, dark. Like, you not, it was always, like, a little, little, little too less early and shit like that. So... You know what I mean? I can, you know what I mean, definitely pretend to that. But I want to say this. It's about skinny me. I want to know your household. You had the two parents or you just had your Let the people know uh, I had, uh, how, how was your household and shit. Now, you, you know, can, we grew up with structure, but I had both of my parents. You dig what I'm saying? Like, mm. I never was, I never was a nigga that was like, oh, it was, it was left-sided. You dig what I'm saying? Like, we grew mm. up with structure. You dig what I'm saying? My brothers, I'm, I'm like, I'm damn near... I'm like, the, I'm like the youngest damn near, you know what I'm saying? You're like, a baby boy. Yeah, damn near, you dig what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But like sharing a house, sharing, sharing a room with my brother Bear, you dig what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Got a bunch of other brothers that's older than me. Got my mm-hmm. brother Chuck, got my brother Nula, got my mm-hmm. little brother Hemsay, you dig what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Got my, my, ba- my baby brother, my baby mm-hmm. brother died, you dig what I'm saying? That's like, he died in the house. You dig what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. Before we, before we get there, before we get there, to that, to to that, because that's a tragedy at a young age that you experienced. I definitely want to, definitely tap on that next. But I want how many? So it's all, it was all boys. It was nah, all boys. Nah, nah, it's 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 girls, but it's like okay. this. My pop, it's about eleven, twelve of us. Strong. Mm. Majority mm. boys. See everybody, mm. see everybody think Bayak my oldest brother. <laughs> you dig mm. what I'm saying? Bayak not my oldest brother. You dig what I'm saying? Well, let the people know. I got an older brother that's from Southwest. Mm. He died and he died in like nine seven nine nine six nine seven. He died on mm. a motorcycle. His name was Whistle. Mm. I mean, have you, have you ever seen that little that little Phillies Legends page? He yeah. all over that. He all over that page. You dig what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. One of yeah. the swag, one of the swag. He's a fly. He, he's a he was a fly killer. You dig what I'm mm. saying? Get money. You dig what I'm saying? Speed. He like the thrill of them bikes though. That's one reason mm. why I don't like bikes. I don't like bikes and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, but he liked the bikes. Like wow. truck, truck hitting, bike crushing. Mm. You wow. dig what I'm saying? Bike crushing. That's the that's my oldest brother. You understand mm. what I'm saying? So it's just like so you lost bike. one brother. One brother bike. Yeah, yeah your oldest. I, I I lost the oldest. Then I lost the baby. Mm. You feel me? Like, I lost the oldest and I lost the baby, but I lost the baby, brother. Like, he couldn't snap out of a seizure. You understand what I'm saying? Let the but people like, know. Now, I, I want you to tap all the way in on this because I dropped a little mini clip. And, you know what I mean? It was crazy. People, people couldn't believe it because people, like, your story is just so amazing, bro. Like, there's so much shit. Like, you know what I mean? We definitely got to do a movie or documentary or something. Yeah, it's so much yeah. that you experienced. So the people, you know, that, that, that clip went viral and people wanted to know more about that situation. So let's let's go over all the way into that. So you lost like, a brother early on. Coming yeah, up. Yeah. Let the people I probably, know. I probably, was, I, probably was like, I probably like 13, 14. 
But my little mm. brother, like, it's crazy because I was told to go check on him. You dig what I'm saying? But my other little brother was kind of like laying on my legs and shit, so I couldn't even get up. So my mind had to go out there and check on him. Mm. So my mind get up there. My mind just like, just like scream. Like it was like, a, like it was like a death scream. You know what I'm saying? You know, like I remember this shit like vivid. Like it was like a, like a death scream. And made me just jump up and just go upstairs. You dig what I'm saying? Mm. He just like he just like laying there and shit. You know what I mean? You know I'm trying like I'm trying like you know the average kid not even thinking to even help. For real, for real. You dig what I'm saying? Like they don't mm. know what the fuck to do. But my first instinct is to help. You right. understand what I'm saying? So my whole thing is you know they say I know one thing when they say like people having seizures like don't let them swallow their tongue. So for example, I go the spoon, you know what I'm saying, trying to hold his tongue, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying? Mm-hmm. like, mm-hmm. I'm just like, CPR, like, mouth and mouth, and he's trying to, like, help him, my mom, mm-hmm. like, just, my mom just there screaming, you understand what I'm saying, right, mm-hmm. and that right there, it just, like, it made me and my mom so tight to the point that it was, like, favoritism in the house, you understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying, mm-hmm. because, like, out of all the kids, like, I was the one that helped, Mm. I, couldn't, I couldn't say shorty. Wow. You understand? You understand what I'm saying? So mm. it's like, how you think I feel? It's like I letting down. You feel what I'm saying? A son to his parents at a young age and shit like that, and we frequently go through th- shit like that. Being from Philly, especially North Philadelphia, man, you experience that at your early age. What's the yeah. first? I want to ask you this. Was that the first time, like, you felt death close? Yeah. It was like, I heard of, I heard mm-hmm. of people, like, dying. Mm-hmm. I had never, like, until I see it, see it, like, see it, a, a lifeless, like, my little brother was lifeless, like, mm-hmm. like, my brother died. Mouth open, eyes wide. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Trying, mm-hmm. like, helping. You dig what I'm saying? To my, to this, and to this day. I could, I sat at the edge of the bed, and that's what I think about. It's like some reason about the edge of the bed, and I just sit there and just think about that shit. Nah, that shit's going to snap in my head. Boom, pop in my head. Boom. I might not even talk. That's where, like, when I got my silence come from. I, like, I never really say, like, like mm. I'm outspoken to a certain extent, but if you, like, the household, they'll tell you, I don't really say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, right. I'm like, I, I couldn't save him. You understand mm. what I'm saying? So as I grew up, I want to protect and save everybody that's around me. Wow, wow. That's just, that's just how I am. So it's just like it's like it's a it's like sometimes it's like it's a black cloud over me because yeah. some people look at it like some people just just view me like a whole strange way, and I know how they view me because I see it like on Instagram and like YouTube mm-hmm. and shit. They view me a strange way, but nah. It's deeper than what you, how you view me. You understand what I'm saying? Like you view me wrong. You understand what I'm saying? And I and, like, I, and I think it'd be more so the people on the internet and shit like that, because you know niggas know in the, in the streets know who you know. I mean, know your story, got bits of it, and know you know. What I mean, you know. What I mean, some of the shit you went through, like you know. What I mean, so you know. What I mean, you get the you get these motherfuckers to get on the internet and just you know. Just this got got woof of skinny me when you know when you was around Ab and you know what I mean not knowing all this shit you went through you know what I mean before you went to Ab what made you and shit like that yeah, and I'm here they, to display that like they act like they act they act they act like I'm Hitler or somebody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean I mean I mean the thing about it is the environment you know what I mean the environment you came yeah. you came uh, yeah, we come from and shit like that like. You know what I mean? I just, you know, I'm asking these questions about, you know what I mean, you you experiencing death at an early age because I can, I, I, I can straight, you know what I mean, we can talk about that. Like, you know what I mean? I had yeah. that done to me. Like, you know what I mean? I had, I had, you know what I mean? It was my situation a little, a little, a little different, you know what I'm saying? Because of, you know what I mean? Lil got killed, you know what I mean? One, one thing about death, it should all hurt the same. Yeah, 100%. You feel me? No, no, I'm talking so, about the circumstances. Yeah, the hell yeah. No, as as we as, 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 as we speed up, right? Huh? I, I said as we speed up, a lot of my friends got murdered. A lot of them. There. 
want to get there. Right. I want to get there. About, I'm talking about. I'm talking about. Let me explain something to you. Zai got murdered. Zai from Crosskey and Burks, 24 from Burks. You know what I'm My man, Shy got murdered. Crosskey and Burks. You understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Solid, solid individuals. Yeah, Zai and Shy. My cousin Wood. My old is you name it right here. That's that's the yeah. nigga that I, you know, we came under looking. Sometimes, it was all it was an OG all individuals. My, you know what I mean, from the um, end and shit like that. My cousin, I'm just saying, my, but like, I don't want to confuse the people before, and I don't want to cut your wisdom, bro. I just want okay. to get this squared away. I'm saying you was your situation was probably a little worse than my situation because it's like, you know what I mean. When you lose somebody and you don't have control, like I can go. You know what I mean? Release the pain of doing something to someone or whatever the case may be. Or, if, you know, in my situation, you just lose your brother. That circumstance doesn't really, yeah, like, you know what I mean? You really got to question God on that. So I, I think that's a little yeah. worse. Like, you know what I mean? Losing them and then you trying to, you know, you saving. You saving. Uh, that's a heavy, that's I'm a heavy, like, heavy. I'm trying to help, Mac. I'm trying to help him, Mac. Like, my sisters, my brothers, everybody in my neighborhood can just, like, vouch for this. You understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah, you had to like man. sit there and like pumping. You dig what I'm saying? Like, it wasn't working. I don't guess I was, I don't think I was strong enough. It's crazy, it's funny, man. It's crazy. It, it's definitely crazy. You know what I mean? Cause it's like, Wolf, what do you think about that shit, bro? We sh- we supposed to receive therapy like after experience and shit like that. We, you know, we don't seek it, and it, do- it it's not preached to us. From our end or whatever these hoods, whatever the case may be, get the proper help and shit like that. Yeah. But just experiencing that, that's like your first, your first traumatic experience. And like you said, after that, that's that's I, death. Yeah, but I just dealt with it with like being quiet all the time. You dig what I'm saying? Mm. Like, bro, no bullshit, bro. I was stuck in the 29th Street show, bro. Mm. I just learned. I just learned how to like. Fuck with people, you understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying, bro? Mm-hmm. Bro, mm-hmm. I experienced a lot of death. I'm talking about death from there. Like, I grew up in the young age to where it was like, all right, you ain't had to be from my block order for me to be connected and love you. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like yeah. I said, like I like I just named a name Za, a name Sha. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. dude, I murdered. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like, I care about them. I love them. They love me. You dig what I'm saying? Like, mm. God got is... murdered. Then it's like, more deaths. You dig what I'm saying? Like, my mm-hmm. cousin, my cousin would get murdered. You dig mm. what I'm saying? Then mm. it's like, it's more deaths. You, 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 you understand what I'm saying? Mm. So, it's just like, Nobody want to die. Yeah. I mean, like, mainly get killed by somebody. You you understand what I'm saying? Like, yeah. just imagine these dudes is dying while I'm in middle school. Mm. My cousin would die when I got out of school. But just imagine, like, Za, Sha, you dig what I'm saying? Lord Ralph. Damn. You, you, you understand what I'm saying? Like, they not even, like, from my block, but we so mob tied then. You understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, oh, these dudes is like. That's big L's. That's, that's big L's. Big L's. Yeah. Big L's. Yeah. And I want to see this and shit like that. Because I know, you know what I mean? When, when Lil got killed, it kind of fucked me up. Like, I ain't, I, I had stopped going to school and shit like that. I want to ask you this. Like, what, what point of time you, you stopped, like, going to school and really, you know what I mean? Like, feel like you fell off track. Of which, you know, what I mean, the direction you want to go in life and shit like that. I ain't, you know I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hold you. I, I put a bulletproof vest. I had a bulletproof vest, right? I got a bulletproof. Vest. I'm going to vault. I'm going to rob a vault. So right on. Oh, you went to vault and shit. Yeah. <laughs> they tried to send school. me the vault. <laughs> that was my, that was, that was my, that was my school. You'd have had the red carpet. That was my school. I was talking about rules. I went, I went to rules and shit like that. I but went wait. from vault. Vaults went from fifth to the eighth. So, I remember. I went from Fox from the fifth grade, so this is how like I know it, like a bunch of older motherfuckers. Like this is how I know like Ani and Sandel chipping them from Francisville, shit like that. Mm-hmm. That's how like mm-hmm. they the guys. You you understand what I'm saying? 
But I'm younger. I'm in the fifth grade when they in the grade they in sevens and eights or whatever. You dig what I'm saying? But yeah. Big John, like drama bust off around the way. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. Like you know, you know, house parties, house parties eventually turn to shootouts. You dig what I'm saying? Turn to fights, mm. turn to shootouts. You understand what I'm saying? So, yeah. you know, young nigga, shit goes on. But I'm in Vox with a bulletproof vest on. In my locker, I'm in, I got a bulletproof vest in my locker. The fucking teacher noticed me putting the vest on. I say it's a fucking G unit jacket and take off running. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, I can't go to school no more. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to jail. <laughs> you, you, you understand what I'm saying? I'm going to some, I'm going to some juvenile shit. I ain't, you know, mm. I, ain't, oh. I ain't going, I ain't going if I got a bulletproof vest on in school, though. I find oh, nervous, bro. I know it was yeah, real. I, I, and I, I remember, like, when you just look back and analyze shit, like, because I remember that, that's how we was just, like, we just was brought up so much in the wrong way. Like, because it's like, damn, I remember the same shit. How old was we in middle school vaults? You, like, 15, 16? But I remember yeah, I was in the wrong We was bringing gags to school. And it was like, damn, that's what that's the environment we was around. Band waistline, ain't hold no belt. That's where that thing at. Body snatchers rushing your spot. And get your mom sacked. 50, 50 yards yard back. back. That 50 shot mag. That pussy boy hustle for echo. Oh. Where your bundles at? Huh? I fucking know that. Bring your true color. Oh. I aim and let it pop out. He was known for selling Johnny. Shots in that magic. This a barrel. See ya, I call cousin Ashley. Tell about that homie. Get your body snatched. Somewhere far they can't find it. Same mad flow. You still pause when you rap. Reach and clap your back. Shit to smoke like that reefer. He was jerking y'all niggas, pay y'all sneakers, clock for fever, that's my favorite eater, whoever know you're about to live a deep freezer, shot my nigga mine, play fucking Cena, back to Felicia, all my niggas dicker, late night McDonald's, Big Macs, what she give us, a large order.